A pleasure to meet y'all at last, and welcome back to Hot Wheels Hilarity. And now, once again, this is the same exact layout that I had before, but you're going to want to get ready because in a few seconds you're going to see for yourself that the U-turn is still there, everything else is still in place, but this is the new 2018 Hot Wheels Booster with a four-lane intersection. And of course the hill right here with the high-profile curve is still there, and another curve is still there with the blue track. But the booster is going to be the one thing that is going to make a difference. Plus there's also some high wall track that you can see that will come out of the booster because of course when a booster propels a car upward there actually is going to be some problems for it if there are tracks with lower walls on them so you can see for yourself that the tracks that will go after the booster are going to be higher wall. There's also a few gray scratches on there somehow. I don't know how that happened but I'm probably gonna find out for myself. But anyways I'm hoping that this time at least some of the cars that I have for this layout will be making it. So this is what's going to continue the story about all of these cars right here. All of these cars are the same exact ones that you saw in the first part of this episode but of course the booster will hopefully make a big difference here and of course we can learn how some cars just don't fit well in the launcher so I'm gonna skip the explanation as to how cars don't fit in the launcher sometimes and we're gonna find out how well they do here first up let's do the Porsche Carrera GT Sinestra made it surf and turf forward speed wow another one made it 71 Dodge Challenger and you also made it pedal D metal Wow another one already audacious I'm having problems with the curves right there 2006 Dodge Charger SRT8 and you made it too 1970 Chevrolet Chevelle okay that wasn't good Lotus Esprit Also made it. Skull Shaker. Sure as heck not as good. Mazda RX-7. Made it. Wow. Tricera Truck. Two thousand five Ford Mustang. Another one. <laughs> Seventeen Ford F one fifty Raptor. You're still a little wide there. Bot wheels. Why? You just couldn't do it? Dodge Charger Stock Car. Another one takes it? Nice. Five Alarm. I knew you could do it. 
Porsche 934 Turbo RSR. You couldn't do it? Infinity G37. Awesome work. 2001 B Engineering Adonis. And you can't do well on the booster? The Embosser. So plowed. And finally we have ourselves a 72 Ford Ranchero. And wow, would you look at that. Right then and there we got ourselves a good number. 14 cars had managed to make it all the way. That is a pretty good amount of tides being turned right there. Because apparently the booster made a really big difference right there. The high profile wall track that followed the booster also seemed to help some cars stay in the track as they made it up the hill and then all the way to the finish. Everybody else over here, they just couldn't really do too well. And I was expecting the Carrera GT and the Idanis to do well here because they both did well last time making it up towards the hill but once again not every car can do it well some cars can just do very well here so I hope that you enjoyed this episode of Hot Wheels Hilarity and I hope that you stay tuned for more coming soon